Hello, denizens of the deep, near and far. It's time for Deep IO News with Bagelmaster4107 and iWormify. First off, the servers have now updated, so if you've wanted to play the new maps for Swampy Shores, now's your chance. Mapmakers have been able to update their maps, so they're still fixing some early issues. The maps will be more refined soon, and here's the Wormifier to tell you all about them. We're going to talk about Emmy's map, the FFA map. I feel like there's too many waterfalls, like in the Estuary Shallows. Also, the ocean in the middle is just way too open. However, I do appreciate the prop placement, it feels like it was done properly. The little tunnels are also a nice little feature added to it too. So after playing the map a bit, I give it a solid 7 out of 10. Next, we have the... Odd news of strange clusters of AI animals being spawned pretty much right out of the sky. Posts all over the Reddit have been flooding in with reports of these strange happenings across Debio, but they all shared one thing in common. It only happened on maps made by Emmy. Was this some sort of glitch? Well, back in the Crabnet discussions, it didn't take long to figure out what was going on. Emmy had been doing some minor trolling and used the mapmaker tool to update his maps mid-game and dump loads of NPC animals into lobbies causing mayhem everywhere. Needless to say, it was pretty funny. However, you don't have to worry about it anymore as the maps were locked and can no longer be updated until Feed approves them too. No more sky orcas for you all. And then, a more mild uh, news update. But now there is only one custom server left. After the update of the new, new servers, uh, the new maps are in, however, there are no more custom servers except the original mini planets. So if you were looking forward to playing on one of those crazy custom maps and spamming Grongulus everywhere, uh, you can't only do that on one map now. And now, the big news. This is pretty exciting, and I hope you all feel the same way. I'll let Wormify handle this one. He, uh... Also decided to try and do a Mega Mew impression? I have no clue, just get... Sure, I'll, I'll go with it. Sorry, Mega Mew. Hello everybody, what's up? It's your favorite Orca made disliker, the Wormifier, and today we're gonna be talking about the shark donation thing, yay! Everyone, please welcome Mega Mew. Hello, Deep Heart. Just want to let you guys know that we are gonna try doing something fun for once. And help fund shark conservation projects by adopting and naming a silky shark. The goal is $350 and donations won't just come from this server as I will do stuff viral as well. But where's the fun of that? A GoFundMe link can be found below and you can make a donation however big it will be massively appreciated. Thank you Warbify. And thank you too, Mega Mew. And next, let's talk about... No, Warbify, wait! A largest donator gets to help pick out names that you guys will vote on. Also forget to say thanks to Megalon, Sea Cheese, and Barbara for the art. I gotta say, Warbify, that's probably the, um, uh, the, um, best Mega Mew impression that I have ever heard. It sounds exactly like him. But that's all we've got for today. So, I'm Bagelmaster. I'm Wormify. And I'm Mega Mew. Fair the whale. Mm -hmm.